All this week on Dateline Schools, we're learning about the Little Libraries Program. It's an effort here in St. Clair County to get our kids reading, not just during the month of March, which is Na National Reading Month, but all year long. And tell us all about it. My special guest is the Assistant Director of Language Arts here at St. Clair County, RISA, Jennifer Evans. And, and Jennifer, how did you guys get this idea started? And, and has it been kind of simmering for a while? You're just now getting action? Or is it just something brand new? Well, the Blue Water Reading Council is kind of reestablishing its roots. And so that was one way that we wanted to connect to the community. We really wanted this to be more about our community rather than just about the schools. And the other thing that happened is the state of Michigan came out with these literacy essentials. And the K-3 literacy essentials, one of those essentials is to have adequate materials available for kids mm -hmm. and so tying those two pieces together where where can and how can we support our blue water area with books and making sure kids have access to books easily that's kind of what spurred this idea so this idea then is really to get these little libraries out in communities but you're really focusing on books for the kindergarten the third third grade group right well actually we're probably is that's more of our target those are more of the books that we're collecting but we also have all through upper L so you know I would say k5 level books are what we're we're stocking it with. A lot of them are even some preschool books because we know we want to make that connection sure. with our preschool population as well. So how big are these little libraries that uh, you have out on somebody's lawn to, to have they're, these books? They're so big, you know, <laughs> and, and they they hold about 50 books, oh, wow. and okay. so they have little doors that open, and um, they've painted them. They have nice little roofs on them. So, you know, the idea is that they're pleasing to look at, but also easily accessible. Now, is this something that you have to kind of police to make sure if somebody takes a book, they bring it back or anything or is it just all a volunteer system it's volunteer and, and you know it's really built off of the fact that you know once we teach kids we actually have lesson plans so the teachers could explain to the kids how the little library works uh, once we go through that process we really want them to understand that we want to have a literate community. We really want people to be able to read and share the love of reading regardless of your age. And so that's what it's about in sharing. We'll be back with more tomorrow. For Dateline Schools, I'm Terry Harrington.